It's Wednesday the 20th of April and here are your headlines. The Vice-Chancellor at Rhodes University has suspended classes. Yesterday, police used tear gas to disperse crowds demonstrating over rape, and they've gathered again this morning. Last week, an anonymous source published a list of names on a confessional student website. The list is said to be the names of alleged rapists and alleged sexual assailants on campus. Police have yet to release a statement on arrests reported this morning. About 2,000 residents from Zandspreit are marching for electricity connections. Police spokesperson Major Mac Ntomezulu said the situation had become volatile, with protesters blocking off Bayer's Nordi Drive. In March, Zandspreit residents faced off with police over cut electricity in days of violent protest. And finally, a visually impaired man says studying photography was challenging but fun. 22-year-old Donovan Boerter is the first visually impaired person to study at Chwane University of Technology's Department of Visual Communication. Boerter said it was challenging when other students could see the finer details of their work and he could not. He'll receive his diploma in May and plans to start his own photography business. For these and other breaking news stories, go to news24.com.